Hi everyone, it's Miss Goldman. Uh, we are here for our next math lesson of Eureka Module 5. This is lesson 25. And as always, if you are using the PDF as a printout to help you see the pictures better and draw these, that's fine. Make sure you are sending me pictures so you will get uh, credit for the work that you've been doing because I know you all have been working really hard. And as always, if I'm going too fast, press pause and let's get started. So for these first problems, what we're going to be doing is, as you can see, we have one whole thing right here. It's right here. It equals one whole. And I said one whole, equal, which equals three thirds. So what you're going to do is tell me how much each of these equals. So for example, this is one, two, three shaded, but they're halves, so it's three halves. So take your time to do this. All right, I'm going to be going over the answer. So if you need more time, just press pause. So now we're going to go over the answers to these. As we said before, that first one here is three halves. So check if you got it right. This next one is three ones, which is really three holes. So you could have also just written as three because three over one is a whole. Over here, we have four over four. Four halves, four over one again because there's four holes, so it's one. Six sixes, six thirds, and six ones again, or just a six. So you could have ran this as a four or as a six as well. So let's keep going. So for this next problem, what we're going to be doing is as you, um, filling in the missing whole number in the boxes below on the number line and renaming the whole numbers as fractions in the boxes above the number line. So as you can see, I did this first one for us, so it gives us our whole numbers down here. So it has zero, so I put zero over one. Now over here, we have 10 over one, so what's this gonna be? It's gonna be a 10. So I want you to work on these next problems. All right, I'm going to go over the answers now. As you can see, we have 1 over 1. Here, I'll do this in color so you can see. 1 over 1, 2 over 1, 3 over 1, 4 over 1, 5 over 1, and 6 over 1. But really, we know it would be 1 1s, 2 2 1s, 3 1s, 4 1s, 5 1s, 6 1s. On this bottom, as you see, number line right here, as you see, we're doing a mix. So we have 10 ones, 10, 11 ones, 11, 12 ones, 12, 13 ones, 1, 14 ones, 14, 15 ones, 15, 16 ones, 16. So hopefully very, very simple. And you also had this bottom problem here to help you. So let's keep going. So for this 
Next problem, we have to explain the difference between these two fractions with words and pictures. So we have two ones and two halves. So I will tell you, they are different. They're not the same, so take your time. All right, we're gonna go over the answer to this last problem. So, as you see, I drew it out, and I said the fr and here's two ones, and here's two, two halves. So I wrote the first one, two ones, is one whole, and two halves is one whole and another half. So, as you can see, they are different. And again, this is our last problem for this lesson. So I will see you tomorrow. Hopefully I will see you in our live lesson, which will be as always at 11 o'clock. I miss you. Stay safe. Stay smart. Be smart. And go for the gold. Bye.